four different types of green onions. Green onions can be any type of onion that has been picked before it's fully grown. These baby or immature onions are different from bulbing onions in both appearance and taste. Green onions have a sleek linear shape with white or pale green bulbs and long green tops. Both the bulb and the stalk are edible. They're milder and sweeter than the mature onions and found extensively in many cuisines, including Chinese and Japanese. They're also known as scallions, spring onions, or salad onions. 1. Green onion. The vegetable known as the green onion comes from a species the Allium fistulosum family. They can be harvested one of two ways, either early in the season before the bulb starts to grow or afterward, once the bulb is attached. Some people confuse green onions with spring onions, but there is an easy way to tell the difference. The bulbs on a green onion are much smaller than the bulbs on a spring onion, so if the bulbs are large, it is considered a spring onion. If you cook with green onions, you'll notice that you do not cry while you're cutting them, in part because they are a very mild type of onion. The white part close to the stem contains the most flavor, but you can eat the entire onion either cooked or raw. If you're wondering about the difference between green onions and scallions, think no more about it. Green onions are mild and need little to no cooking time. You can cook with the entire stock if you wish, the white lower portion as well as the green leaves. Green onions are used to season hundreds of foods, and they are very popular in Asian dishes, especially stir-fry dishes. They are also used to season a variety of stews, soups, and garnish on whatever it is you're cooking. 2. Spring onions. Spring onions look similar to scallions, the latter also called green onions. So it's easy to confuse spring onions and green onions. Sometimes the easy way to tell them apart is from the bulbs. If the ends are very bulbous, it's a spring onion. And they get their name because they are harvested in the spring. Because their growing season is longer than the green onion, spring onions usually have a more pungent taste but they have a unique flavor that is sweet, crispy, and savory all at the same time, making them the perfect accompaniment to many dishes. You can eat spring onions raw or cook them with a variety of vegetables, and recipes containing these onions are not difficult to find. 3. Leeks Though they look like jumbo scallions, leeks are actually quite different than other types of green onions because they do not produce cloves or bulbs. They are also much larger in size, up to 2 inches in diameter and up to 10 inches in height. Their root is white in color and cylindrical in shape, and the vegetable is earthy and mild in taste. When you cook leeks, they become silky but they are very crunchy when eaten raw. When compared to all other types of onions, leeks are considered the ones with the sweetest taste. Leeks have fan-shaped dark leaves at the top and peak in the early spring or late winter. They are low in calories but high in vitamin C and iron. They have a specific taste and can be used as a base for dishes that include beans and even pasta. Leeks grow in sandy soils and have open stalks, so they collect a lot of sand between their layers and need to be washed thoroughly before cooking. 4. Chives. Chive is a small perennial plant of the Amaryllis family, related to the onion and can grow up to 2 feet in height. Chives are grown as ornamentals for their attractive flowers and as a potherb for their flavorful leaves. The leaves can be used fresh or dried and are a common seasoning for eggs, soups, salads, and vegetables. Chives are very commonly used as a garnish and are usually classified as an herb instead of a vegetable. Their flavor is somewhat like garlic and is very light and delicate, however, they can be very strong and intense, so if you use just a little of them, they will go a long way. Chives bear small white elongated bulbs and thin tubular leaves, which grow in clumps. Dense spherical umbels of bluish or lilac flowers rise above the foliage. They characteristically produce only a few seeds. Chives may be propagated by planting seeds but are cultivated more commonly by dividing the clumps and planting the tiny bulbs. They have a lot of vitamins, including vitamins A and C, as well as potassium and calcium. They are also used extensively in many fine restaurants, thanks to their mild but very versatile taste. Try it. Let the food be your medicine, and the medicine your food. Share and make your loved ones aware because health is wealth.